Sleep away, young child. Twist and turn in the dark. Dream lightly on. I relate our tale of woe, woe in all its depth of saddening loss, the madness so long endured, the waste of youth demanded, mother's grief handed down, creeping of seasons past seasons, hush, hush, wake not, sleep.
in the seat. I'm going to have to have a look. So those guys play loud. <coughs> I'd just like to say before I read the next poem that um, I'm one of 12 children that my mother had in 17 years. Um, getting her attention was a challenge at times. Yet when I was around 8, 9 and 10, each summer for the month of August, my parents would take a boy my age out of an orphanage. He would share the bed with my brother and I slept in. I couldn't believe he called my mother Mammy and he got fed before me. So 30 years later, here I am on Nantucket watching Kate's documentary about the Bulgarian orphans. Having worked with Bulgarian students over the last few years on the island, I developed an interest in the country's history. When Biliana asked Robbie, Armin and I to perform Cacciatorian's lullaby, I was inspired to write this following poem. It's called For the Children, and it's dedicated to the children of Bulgaria. Bygone millennia shadow our present stance. Shape people's pride in telling cultural strides. Awaken us to distant ages' clamor of perilous deeds. Flush with courage to dare. All nations show their better side, hide blatant disgraces. As such dictated down annals of human time. Nowadays, propelled by global design within and out, we slowly turn full face Cast off our masks, those baffling stares of rectitude. Heed current tide of dew. At times, humanity's moving gaze surveys emergent states of neighbor's will unshackled. Spotlights a jarring shame shatters country's brittle moors, portrays with stubbornness a glaring act of willfully neglecting some, demands an altering tsunami for fairer care of kin. Once rectifying shifts reveal shared kindness, gathers every child in traditional quilt of parental measures, where full embrace drains the past, centuries of damning solitude. Then a land lives with children's joy gains mountain grace to dance full on toward modern stage where happy life for all is vaulted aspiration.